Hi, I am Pranti Luxing and welcome to my 5 Minutes of Culture. Before we start cooking, I'm going to teach you a little bit about Ghana, its culture, and a little bit about the history of this little guy right here, Peanuts. Ghana is located in West Africa and is home to many dishes, dances, and most importantly, festivals. Festivals are usually held for family fun or a family reunion, dancing, worshiping, or praying to a god, or like back to this festival, the mark of the fishing season. Have you learned a little bit about Ghana? Now I'm going to teach you a little bit about peanuts. Peanuts came a long, long voyage before they came to Africa. Mostly, it wasn't even in Africa at all. It started a long, long time ago around Brazil and Peru. Peanuts originated in South America during the Inca Age. Ancient Incas made the first documented peanut paste and peanut butter during the colonial times. It was later given to European explorers during the Inca's decline and was planted on plantations and fed to slaves. And later on, it was brought back to Africa. Now that we learned a little bit of Ghana, now we're going to make the dish. To make this dish, you need a mortar and pestle, or a blender, it doesn't matter. Two avocados, or one avocado, chopped up. Teaspoon of lime juice, I'm freshly squeezing it. It doesn't matter how much you put in there. Paprika. Chili powder. Cinnamon. Peanuts salted or shelled, non-salted. Well, chopped up chives is optional if you want a fresh flavor. Now let's get mixing. First, you'll need to put in the peanuts. Next, put in a teaspoon of paprika. Half a teaspoon to be exact, because you don't want it to be too thick. Then you'll need half a teaspoon cinnamon. Then you need some chili powder, half a teaspoon, because you don't want it to be all crazy hot. Pinch your salt if you don't have salted peanuts. I mean, if you don't want it to be too oh, salty, I recommend not putting any salt. Lime juice. Two limes to be exact, or if you don't want it to be that flavorful, I recommend just putting in a half teaspoon juice. Lime juice. And optional sprinkle of chives. I'll be putting in chives. We don't put the avocado in this mixture yet. We just put this in a separate bowl. Put it on this side. Now let's get pounding. avocados yet. Now we, I recommend putting in the fridge to chill for about, I don't know, five to ten minutes. And also with the avocados for a fresh taste.
to ten minutes has passed. Now let's go get the sauce. To serve this dish, you need about like four to three separate slices. So let's put in one. And then serve the sauce. Now it's time for the taste test. I've been waiting for this. Mmm. I recommend this. It's good. Now that we finished taste testing, now let's move on to fun facts. <laughs>